or they could postpone the launch. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Liftoff! We have liftoff! Houston, you're in control! Roger, Kennedy, thank you. Headwind's nominal, low window booster separation at 236 seconds. That is sweet! What am I gonna have to do before they let me become an astronaut? You'll have to work really hard, Koji. Work? Oh, man. Like starting today? Starting whenever you want to be an astronaut. All clear for rocket booster separation. And 45 till over. Transform. Hey, sweet. This is a textbook perfect battle maneuver. They think Movor is their space shuttle. Now Movor only has to locate the Autobot base and we can attack and destroy it. Child's play. <gasps> Ah, now this is the life. It's like a zero-gravity tanning salon up here. No more final countdowns or booster tanks. That thing almost gave me a hernia. That's one big cloud. That'd be great cover if I was launching an attack. Movoir, quit daydreaming. We're ready to attack. Get us the coordinates for the Autobot base. Yes, sir. Coordinates for one Autobot base coming right up. Yeah. Why don't we just start simple and track an Autobot or two? Where are you, stinking Autobots? Ha! Huh, looks like this one's bringing some cargo back to base. Ha! Huh. You were in front of the same fire hydrant last week, little man. No parking! Wow, unbelievable! All these violations are gonna make this a hectic afternoon. Let's go, little man! Come on! Why are you so careful with those stupid cars? Quit towing things around and go back to base, you mindless drone. Could you possibly be more in touch with your inner Autobot? Bingo! Look no further than a cop. Prowl's perfect, do-gooder. Maybe you'll be kind enough to lead me back to the Autobot base. I can't catch him. I need backup. He just hit the on-ramp. He's headed for Quadrant 3. They're coming this way, and they're going to need my help. All available units, full pursuit in effect. Suspect is in a purple sedan, headed eastbound on the Harbor Freeway. This is Unit 3. Hang in there, guys. I'm on the case. Where's this guy going? Pull over to the right immediately. Cease and desist! You are under arrest! This is Unit 3 in hot pursuit! What? That crafty little cop is hiding from me. Are they on to us already? It looks like they called him decoys! So tell me, Scourge, what novel information does Mover have vis-a-vis -vis the global positioning of the enemy land? Sir? Where are the Autobots hiding? Sir, we have not yet heard from Mover. Come in, Mover! Respond! Have you located the Autobot headquarters yet? Yes. No! What? Here's a little game for you guys. Pin the laser on the Autobot. Which one is Prowl, huh? I think I see him in the top right corner, Muvor. No, I think he's in the bottom left. Come on, I see him. He's right in the middle, one of those two. Fools, even if you find Prowl, he's caught up in a car chase. Muvor, identify any Autobot headed back to base. Hey, this ain't easy. Not with the optics I scanned in from the shuttle. Find one now, before I scan you into sheet metal. Find one now, Muvor. Where are the Autobots, Muvor? That impatient freak, I don't see him doing anything. What is that? Look, I told you before, we're doing a cheekbone. The cheekbone is not the nose. It doesn't curve, so stop pulling so hard. No, tell them they have to go a little bit to the right. Okay, now, you gotta start turning to the right. All right, it curves. Just a little bit at the end. It's not like this is the Mona Lisa. It's just supposed to be a rendezvous point. <laughs> You're preaching to the choir. As far as I'm concerned, we could have lit a flare for him. A sky bite wants a monument. <laughs> Can't you just see the look in Megatron's eyes as he flies into the rendezvous point? Somehow, when the Decepticon said try drawing Megatron's face in the ground, I thought they were kidding. You think Megatron would want this done before or after we defeat all the Autobots? My money's on after. Ha! They actually did it! That is so lame! Transformer! 
None of the frequencies the space agency gave us for the shuttle are working. Not even the emergency ones. Optimus, any ideas? There might be a blind spot in the orbit, Ty. Try patching in again, through a satellite. Still nothing! <gasps> How did we get x -Bron? Is this the image data we're receiving from the shuttle now? I think so, Optimus, but I'm going back to recheck all of the... <gasps> We've lost the signal again! I knew a gal named Gertie Miguel who was always happy to see me! <laughs> x come in. Is everything all right out there? Oh, everything's boring all right out here, darling. It's beautiful. How about you folks? We're fine if you are. All right, and then we're both fine. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some serious off-roading to do. <laughs> you know, I might need a new set of optics, but that is not the Autobot I was locked on. I'm going to find their headquarters no matter what I have to do. Or the land of the free and the home of the... Uh, hi, fellas. If the art project got there. All of a sudden, today got a little less beautiful. <laughs> you seem to have driven right to your own demise. <laughs> I don't normally say this kind of thing, but uh, this is absolutely perfect. <laughs> When I'm catching flies by your memorial, I may put a flower down sometime. <laughs> We're gonna take you off-road, all right, for good! Don't do it, guys. I've seen this kind of thing in westerns. The guy who's trapped always wins in the end. That's wrong! That's wrong! Now, how many pieces do you want to be broken into? You're vastly outnumbered. Sure you don't want to run? Not a chance, shark butt. Well, have it your way, then. <laughs> He's down! Yeah! x -Bron. Come out, come out, wherever you are! Hey, where'd he go? Man, I can't see a thing! Me neither! <sighs> I'll have to let him go for now. I gotta get back to base and report this. Well, what? Any sign of him? Nothing! Uh, come out! Incident all about face your doom! <laughs> I try to warn him, but would they listen? No. Now I gotta find someone to lead me around the world again before we find their base. And if that doesn't work, I quit. I'm gonna move to the moon or something. There's got to be a reason we can't contact the space shuttle. Strange. Why would the shuttle be tracking x -Bron? Man, I think I might have been having battery palpitations there for a while. x -Bron, what happened to you? What happened? A couple of rodents and a tuna fish with teeth, that's what! You were ambushed by the Predacons. Why didn't you call on us? If I'd had time and a payphone, I might have. But something kept jamming my signal. I don't believe it, Optimus. The shuttle that we've been trying to reach for a while is just a... <sighs> a what, Tom? What's the matter with the shuttle? I'm afraid that ship's a total fake. Because the real shuttle and its crew are hostages. That's what the agency just said. I don't get it. Who would want to launch a fake shuttle up into space? Optimus, are you thinking what I am? Decepticons. It's Movor. I'm sure of it. So it was no mistake that x appeared on our monitor when we tried to patch into the space shuttle's network. Because Movor must have been tracking x -Bron. Little old me? Why would those guys care where I went? Come to think of it, they might have been tracking me. You get the feeling this was move or as well? Uh, I'm such a slacker! I turned the sensors off for a chase! Speaking of slackers, where could Sideburn be? Hold on, Ty. But Optimus, what about move or? I don't think move or is going to attack. You're right. They seem to be using the shuttle to track all of the Autobots' paths. True, but they haven't meant to ambush any of us yet. The Decepticons just might be after something greater. They may be using Movor's ability to trace one of our paths back to here. In that case... Of course. They know where our base was. What? What? Huh? Is that flying piece of tin still daydreaming? I hear you loud and clear, Mega Octane. I may be in orbit, but I'm not deaf. Wonderful. Listen, Movor, have you made progress of any kind in finding the Autobot base? I would have, if it hadn't been for a couple of furballs ditch-digging in the desert. I'm tracking Romeo on wheels now. Hmm, good. Let's follow Sideburn. You got it, Chief. 
Aw, oh, come on, beautiful. Slow down just a little bit. You know I can't resist a shiny red sport model like you. Hey, I know a great little drive-in theater. It's romantic and it's very, very classy. Please tell me it's not that blue sports car again. Oh, it is. It totally is. Hey, blue boy, no tailgating. Just pass on by and lead us to the base. Any time, lover boy, any time. Now, wait a minute. Some of the movies out there are really pretty good. I saw this TV special on one of them about this big ship that started to sink. And, uh... That would only be good if you were on board. Ouch, that hurt, okay? That really hurt. I'm deeply wounded. I'm in pain. Look in the rearview mirror. You see pain, pain right here. Hey, I don't believe our luck today. Here's another one. You know, we don't need to be so nice. <laughs> He's going to come right past us. Uh, just don't stand there gawking. Prepare for battle! Skybite, you're not about to interfere with our strategic planning this time! Planning? What sort of strategy did you intend, a wedding or a cotillion? Listen, Steelhead, if Megatron wanted to laugh, all he'd need is that pathetic sand painting you made! Uh, he, he didn't like it? And there's this movie where dinosaurs go around eating people, and even cars! It's a shame they missed you! Oh, there they are! I have a chance to redeem myself to Megatron with this! Don't do it! Sky by terrorize! That had to hurt. Hey, did you see that? It came right out of the sky. Divine punishment! Uh-huh, uh-huh. Ah! We forgot about the Autobot! He's getting away! They never listen. Hey, you know what? There's another movie we could see about, like, aliens that come down and, like, take over people's minds. They've already succeeded! You're living proof of that! Well, I'm running out of types of movies here. I guess we could go see a documentary or something. I found the base! Sector 12. Excellent. Get ready to annihilate the Autobots from this planet forever. Sir, sir yes, yes sir. sir! Wonderful! By nightfall, my enemy will be vanquished! My fellow Decepticons, behold your true destiny. The only obstacle that separates you from total world domination. Let's move! I do have a sensitive side. I can cry at movies, especially during car crashes. And all of my doors dance surprisingly easily. You know, maybe we could go see one of those movies about actually really falling in love. If it doesn't go on too long. Thank you, but I'd rather eat a mouthful of thumbtacks. Was that supposed to be it? Found an old cola bottle and a comb. Good work, Moovor. We just destroyed a grain silo. Uh, sorry about that small miscalculation. Try the bay in Sector 14. So we're looking for an ultra sacred yacht club? You better be right. Let's move out. Yeah! Cyber, you're not stopping? Uh oh. That was ten empty summer homes. Sorry, uh, try the power plant. That was just a normal power plant, Moovor. Okay, it's the airport! No, the shipyard! Uh... Quit pulling my pranks! You have to tell me where the real Autobots are! See, the thing is, I don't really know. Please, go away! I love you, red car! Stop in the name of true love! Or at least slow down a little. Whoa! Huh? Where'd she go? That car has sweet handling. She just ditched me going twice the speed limit on a hairpin turn. I am so in love. Hey, somebody get me out of here. Well, at least I lost that stupid blue car. Behind every turn Sideburn takes, the Decepticons have been making trouble. And man, looks like that kid's been taking a whole lot of turns. Ty. We'll need to make radio contact with Sideburn. But we can't bring him here. No. Send him to the pier. The Decepticons will follow. What about Sideburn? Once Sideburn lures the Decepticons to the pier, we'll show up to ensure that Megatron never comes around to look for our base again. No problem. Whoa, the whole gang's back at home. What's going on, guys? Sideburn, we need you to go to Pier 7B now. Wait there for further instruction. And that's kind of a problem, guys. I was looking for a missing person. A missing person, huh? I know who you're looking for, and it's that... Sideburn, that cute red car you've been chasing is down on Pier 7B. We all fixed up a date for you. Oh, that's awesome. You guys are the greatest. I'll be there in less than two minutes, I promise. Well, I guess that works. Good work, x -Bron. Autobots, let's roll out to the pier for a little date of our own. Wow, look at 
Looks like he's headed someplace pretty important. Scourge, come in! This better be good. It is. Loverboy's making a beeline for the pier. He must be heading back to base. If you're wrong, you'll pay, Muvor. The kid's headed somewhere important. Move out, yes, sir. Well, here I am, Pier 7B. But I don't see that red car anywhere. She's got to be inside. I can't exactly drive on in there, so it's time for me to get a little creative. Cyber and transform! This makes me much better looking. Going somewhere special, Autobot? I hope that's not my date. So this is the secret Autobot base. Oh, no! I came here to date a cute red car, not these five ugly Decepticon freak shows. Answer the question. Is this the Autobot base or not? What? Don't play dumb, Sideburn. What is that? A uh, lighthouse? Optimus Prime, transform! Extra, transform! Prowl, transform! x Braun, you lied to me, man! I'll never find that red car now, Lughead! Hey, <laughs> Sideburn, just a little joke. We needed some way to get you here, because them Decepticons have been following you around all day. They want the red car? No, they wanted our base. They thought you'd stop flirting long enough to show them where it was. You still tricked me. That red car and me, we really had an understanding today. Uh, Sideburn, we gotta fight now, so drop it. Gotcha. It looks like we might be close to the base after all. Well, it's good enough for me. Let's combine and take care of them right now. That's good tactics. Hold on. We can't do that. We're a man down. Or a man up. We're missing Movor. Forget it. We don't need to look for that base if we can turn the Autobots into scrap metal right here. That'll be the day. Optimus Prime, battle mode! Let's go, Scourge! This is exciting. I had front row tickets to a heavy metal concert once, but this is way better. Now I'll just sit back and watch the action. Look around, Autobots. Enjoy the view, because you won't be around to see it anymore. Drop the rhetoric. It still doesn't make you right. Team Bullet Train, attack! Right on time as usual. Newspike transform. Rapid run transform. Midnight Express transform. Hi there. Don't start fighting all at once, guys. There's no way you can beat all of us. Good point. We don't need to destroy the base if the Autobots' leader is out of the picture. Optimus Prime, you're mine. One-on-one <laughs> -on -one with Optimus? That's gonna leave a mark. The good guy always beats the bad guy if he doesn't get help from his gang. You'll never make it, Prime. You'll never know, Scourge. Okay, he definitely needs me. Targeting? Targeting locked? Argon laser, fire! You metal maggot! You just zapped your own chief! Look, I'm sorry. Just tell Scourge not to move next time. You throw me off. Lasers from space, look, that's hardly sporting. I hate this guy. I really hate this guy. The fight's not over yet, Prime. This time, I got Prime for sure. Prepare to meet your manufacturer. Ready? Aim? Sword of Fury! Fire! Goodbye, Optimus! No! No, no, no! That didn't happen! It wasn't me! I swear! Move, War. You better hope you never set wheels on this planet again. I'd say it's time to pack it in. A good commander knows when to cut his losses, and I'd say he's a big one. I swear I'm gonna turn that loony bin shuttle into metal confetti. I don't think I'm real popular right now. I never found the base. I blew up the wrong stuff, and I shot Scourge twice. Ah! Oh, 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 no! So you see, we 
had to continue using you as the decoy. But what about the red car promise? That was cruel and unusual. Perhaps, but you never would have gone to the pier otherwise. And besides, your pursuit of that red car kept the Decepticons away from our true base. Right, little man. Our secret base is still safe because you have a thing for red sports cars. Before, I've told you away for this sort of thing, but today, you get the thumbs up. If that's the case, I suppose it's okay if I talk to some more of those beautiful cars now. Oh, Absolutely no, you not. don't. We're going to keep a careful eye on you, because if you act this reckless one more time... Aw, oh, man, I knew it sounded too good to be true. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. That's better.